The Melbourne Aquarium or Sea Life Aquarium is located on the corner of King Street and Flinders Street in Melbourne, opposite the Yarra near the Crown Entertainment Complex. What do you see? Shark? You can get a voucher for parking, but it's probably easier or much easier to go by train to Flinders or Southern Cross Station and walk five minutes, or by tram um, routes 70 and 75, or the free tram circle, you'll see it on King Street. This little exhibit was called the Coral Caves Tropical Wonderland at the Melbourne Aquarium and basically kids got to draw a little picture of their own and then scan it in and add it to the other pictures that the other kids have drawn and watch it bob around and swim around in the ocean and they can chase around and say yeah I did that picture and they can even write their name on it, I think I'm not sure if that's in the rules but yeah a good little art activity there's a few more little art activities like this One of the main activities, the Mermaid Aquarium, which is over a $2 million um, exhibit full of sharks and stingrays and beautiful coral fish. In fact, more than 2,000 marine animals. And uh, we really love seeing that. this Juno For us, the main attraction at the Melbourne Aquarium was the uh, the penguin area. I'm going to call it a penguin lair, even though that's probably wrong. But there's um, gentle penguins and king penguins, and the the little ones can swim at actually 36 kilometres per hour, which is pretty fast. But they all flop around and waddle around, and it's really cute. And, you know, the kids love it. The area recreates Antarctica. Well, tries to recreate it. The temperatures from about five degrees Celsius to minus ten degrees Celsius, and it cycles around. And there's a daily fee that tells you about Antarctica and all the different things, and like mischief that the penguins get up to there in the penguin playground. And um, yeah, the, the the pink 
king penguins are the ones with the yellow around their neck and um, they're actually quite tall and uh, I think they grow to about 14 to about 16 kilograms and um, and they're used to living the, um, you're used to seeing these in the cartoons and animation movies and, um, and you get to see them right up close right by there's a special time Then you know? older kids will love learning about these penguins, like little little facts that they give you, like penguins can breathe salt water and they have this little heat capturing system that allows them to capture 80% of the heat that would normally leave their bodies. You're a penguin, do you know? Do you know, there's lots at the top now. I wonder if one's going to slide. Because one slid down before. coming out of the cave. Oh. Good morning, penguin. Oh, here comes some penguins. Hey, guys. Hey, little 